Tell me about what's happened since then and now. What's been the impact of Eden? Bono and myself set up Eden in 2005. It was our first collection um, because we'd been to Africa and fallen in love with the place and continued to work there and realised more and more and more how important trade was in Africa because they want to provide their own housing, their own education, their own welfare and you know the whole team has been working towards proving that we can do a full collection in Africa and working with the factories and um, that's what Danielle has really confirmed for us this season because now 85% of our collection is going to be made in Sub-Saharan Africa which is incredible. When I first joined Eden, it was first establishing what the core classics were, but then from that, I wanted to take graphic elements that I saw on our travels um, and incorporate it in a way that felt familiar into classic, simple silhouettes. So, for example, on some of the garments, um, you see with the leather woven panels, it's done in a honeycomb stitch, um, and we created that concept here and then we bonded these other panels to give them more of a 3D geometric um, effect. And we also have what's called a bird's eye jacquard, a lot of our knitwear with the graphics. And then we have also just some basics in terms of our silk CDC um, tank tops and some you know, basic blouses as well. So we wanted to pepper it with really novelty pieces for the show and for the collection and then also have some pieces that we can wear to work. I see gorgeous dresses, I see leather jackets, yes. but I also see these incredible t-shirts. Mm. Coming to Eden, what I was really excited about is I was given carte blanche to really create these programs uh, how I envisioned. So I picked my most favorite cotton I've ever come across and I was able to work on some really basic uh, t-shirts with some high side slits on the side so you could tuck in the front, leave the back out um, and just be super comfortable in it. I think our focus really is about the fabrics and developing custom fabrics for Eden and it's more about how can we achieve the most beautiful fabric with the actual fibers that we're working with. So, with this collection, it was about elevating it as much as we could with both the design, but also the fabrication. What are your goals for Eden? Where do you see it going? Where do you want to be in five years? I think we just want to grow, continue to grow and, and move with, under Danielle's direction, you know, into um, just a really well-respected, great brand that delivers both in its clothes and on its mission. Well, thank you so much. This has been great. Um, kapow. <laughs>